Welcome back to Sonic Frontiers. Are you ready for another week of Oranos Island? Another week? I think it's going to end here soon. Do you think so? We've got sage well, talking left. That's true, but we, have, we got a lot of hearts to collect in the process. Uh, I so. know, so much love. Okay, I know. that's fine. Well, we, we can collect all the love. All right, let's collect some love then. Let's let's let, let's get some hearts. Bring it on. Steal soldier. some hearts. All right, we're gonna be gonna keep it positive, okay? <laughs> let's just pump the brakes. All right. This okay. is a positive gaming environment. Please, no bully. Do not cyber bully the cyberspace, <laughs> girl. <laughs> just biff right in the go. back of the head. <laughs> here we, here right. we go. Pull the old timer up. And Three, two, one, go. go! I had a thought the other day. Dangerous I thought, as it may I have, be. I have thoughts all the time. I'm concerned that uh, they only happen to you once every few days. <laughs> they show up eventually. They show oh, up to stage. the party. That's right. I was doing a stage. You know how uh, after Sonic left Sega consoles, it was kind of hit or miss when Sonic games would come out. I, I don't want to say Dark Age because that's doom and gloom and also YouTube bait. <laughs> but I'm just thinking of how a lot of the Sonic games were very wild, very out there, kind of hit or miss, and then they started bringing out, like, the original collections and everything. It just seemed like they were kind of throwing everything at the wall to see what stuck. They've they're trying to establish them. They're, they're trying to make money off of them. Oh, yeah. Because, you know, they, they, may, they may be getting, you know, sixes and sevens across the board. But they're selling. But they still, they, they still sell because they're still loyal Sonic fans, and... Some people expect too much from their Sonic games. And I was thinking about that as, you know, looking back, thinking back to the GameCube era, the Wii era, and all that fun stuff. And ah. the fact that Sonic games have sold uh, well enough to have them keep making more. But recently, there's just been some really good Sonic love lately, and I'm, I'm happy for Sonic fans. They've been trying to establish him as, like, you know, an actual media icon. Three. Yeah. Okay. They're trying to establish him as, like, you know, a, a media icon. That, that's why he's doing all these crossovers. That's why he appeared in all those car in that Cartoon Network show. That's why he's, he's, he's in Puyo Puyo Tetris. They're, they're making him a recognizable face, like Mickey Mouse or Mario or something. In the thing is, uh, un unlike Mario, Sonic has an actual voice with attitude and stuff like that. So he's using that to his advantage. That's why he was the first one to make it on the movie scene. That makes sense. <clears throat> well, and also, I think it's a lot harder to make a Mario movie because you need to, you know, establish a world of lore and everything. I know you still have to do that with Sonic, and they did that in the first Sonic movie. But it wasn't as complicated as Mario. I know that sounds really stupid because they're both video game characters with a story you could write on one piece of paper. It just seems like for a movie... Well, for, well, for for Mario, maybe, but Sonic, they've had to deal with, like, the end of the world and shit. I, I know. the It's easier to set up a Sonic movie for a viewing audience than it is to set up a Mario franchise movies, is what I'm going at. Right. Where is that sage? It's right behind me. Oops. Went the wrong way, my bad. I don't know if I like the stage, 4-9. Four 4-9? Nine. Four nine? It's, hey. it's, it's the one with the skateboard. I hate that one. <laughs> That's, yeah, that's is, the one I was having fun. trouble with. Yeah, I'm not, uh, I'm not liking this too much. It's not terrible, but, you know, I, I'm not having the same level of enjoyment as I normally do with other stages in this, uh, in this uh, part of the, uh, the, the world. I think I just felt a camera lock. Ew. <laughs> Ew. All right. Let's oh. find that first red star ring at 120. So Don't uh, like right. that. Another heart icon. There you go. There you go. Oh, and by the way, the only reason I thought that that thought this morning is, is another shower thought of like, wow, Sonic's doing pretty good right now. Stop is, thinking uh, in the shower. Is the uh, let the Lego tie-in that just recently Lego happened? Tie -in? Yeah, Lego. Oh, that's right, they're making a Lego sign, right? Like, you know how Mario has a bunch of Lego sets? Well, now Sonic's getting his own Lego sets. I'm like, hey, good for him. Good for him. So 
It's how they, they, they make money. They gotta make uh, Sonic profitable. So they have him do a lot of stuff, and he's in a lot of things. All right, I'm gonna go back and stop you there for a second. What's wrong with shower thoughts? <laughs> uh, well, really, really nothing. But uh, uh, honestly, uh, I don't like what you think about. What? I'm thinking about the history of Sonic! We were about to play Sonic! What do you want? Why don't, why don't you think about good video games for once, huh? <laughs> <laughs> um, oh wait, there are none. Uh-oh! <laughs> uh <laughs> <laughs> good, I'm good. Now, let's just get to the end now. I'll just start thinking about the bullshit I play all the time. Oh, hello. Uh I haven't really diversified my uh, gameplay as much lately. I mean, I'm uh, done chipping away, just beginning to scratch the beginning of the tip of the surface of the iceberg that is Baldur's Gate. You're diving into Baldur's Gate? I'm, I'm diving into Baldur's Gate. The way I see it, the third one's coming out looks pretty good. I got the first two for really stupid cheap on Switch. Yeah. Why not? Why not give it a shot? See, I still remember Baldur's Gate coming out in the original Xbox. And wow, that makes me realize how old Baldur's Gate is. Is there a difference between that and Baldur's Gate 2 Dark Alliance? Did you uh, ask me, is, is there a big difference? Yeah. I don't recall. I know Baldur's Gate and Baldur's Gate 2 came out in the Xbox, which means it's been a heckin' long time since Baldur's Gate fans got to eat. All right, all my stages are done. Very now nice. It's talk. Now it's time to talk to the siege. Yep, I am hunting down heart icons, and a uh, little fun thing I noticed on the map, if you actually hover over a story sage, it'll tell you how many more heart icons you need to continue the story. I'm hoping I'll find some as I go along here, go into each sage. It is kind of annoying that all the markers on the map the ones that say that they're heart icons, it could just be a speed boost. That's just mean. Uh-huh. Uh, Alright, Sage, can I talk to you? I can indeed talk, can to you. talk to you. Oh, Sage, let's have a chat. You and me. Hey. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. I mentioned it in last episode, but it is really hard to find thumbnails for this series of episodes. Hey, it's all right. It's a, it's a lot of talking to Sage. People it's, understand. It's it's just talking to Sage. Like like they don't like you know move around. They just stand stock still, two feet away from each other, and just blah blah about the ancients and the ruins and my role in this and this and that and all that. And I will say we've got to we've got to stop them and save everyone. As we were uh, starting up this series. I was thinking the, you know, the in-betweens where Sonic's getting an emerald. I thought, mm -hmm. you know, that would make it for a good thumbnail. <laughs> I think I used that once already. Damn it! Well, there are seven Chaos Emeralds! <laughs> you could have done one for every color! Oh well. Oh well, it's fine. It's fine. Alright, next siege. I need siege. 22 heart icons to finish everything. And I, for the life of me, I can't find any. Oh no, not a caterpillar. F finish everything? Like, you're done if you get this last sage? I have two sages left. One story-based oh. that has, that I need 20 more, and one side sage that needs two more. Now I've got five left. <laughs> well, if you're good at finding hearts, if you're good at finding love, you'll be perfectly fine. Because well, I can't find I... it worth garbage. Well, maybe I've found enough, we'll just have to see. Bitch! I hate the caterpillar. So much. Yeah, it's not great. Waste of my GD time. Uh, good dongo? What? One! Ah! Oh! Good dog. Alright, I'm digging for that one. The sage needs only <laughs> one more hard token. I'm gonna fucking dig for it. How the hell do you get- There it is. How do you- how do you get caterpillar ones that are in between the two? Oh my god, I hate everything. Oh, like I that, I guess? I figured it out. You gotta Dang, be swapping rails. Swapping rails! Swapping rails. Bullshit, Sonic! 
Is it really oh. that hard to accept that the Chaos Emeralds are from space, Sonic? Is it really that hard to, to accept? You've been to space! Many times! <laughs> You've been to another planet! Many times! A couple different planets, actually. You've been thrown into alternate dimensions on more times than anybody can ever care to count. Whoa, that's crazy. You're like, whoa, these Chaos Emeralds are from space? That's kind of wild, man. It kind of blows my guy, my GD mind. <laughs> <laughs> my good dog mind. Okay. Next I, sage. There's, I, I have two, a, there's two over here. I, have I need 47! Oh my god. Yeah, uh, I, have, I have a feeling in order to make this plot kind of believable, they had to make Sonic a bit of an idiot for some portions. I mean, maybe he's just having an off day, like he woke up without coffee or ch without chili dogs or whatever he does to get his day rolling. Let's try to make him uh, j just bland enough that he doesn't know what's going on, but he's still there. Just you know. Okay, he's, I, he, he's not he's not exactly the most uh, forward thinking character, I'd say. No. Have you read any of the uh, Sonic comics, by the way? Just one when I was a kid. I was shown a screenshot of one of the original Sonic comics, where he <laughs> started as a human and he hated his mom, but he had Ew, what? He had spiky hair and he looked like Sonic. Yeah. Oh, that's gross, man. Who, who it was that? gross. I hated it. <laughs> And the, and the person showing it off, they were saying, This is Sonic! View him! He's a human this that looks like Sonic! This is the truth This is the truth! No! <laughs> I will send you an image of that comic so you can add it to the video. Enjoy! You, 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 you don't have to do that. I do! Here it is! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Sonic! He can really move! Sonic! He's got an attitude! Sonic! He birthed furries in 93! It was Sonic's fault the furries are here. I feel like nah. it might have been also a Sama Tezuka. I understand now why you locked my friends his in works? Cages and Question mark? Wasn't exactly well, going his to be his works question mark and also uh, he it's used to draw nudy furry mouse Better drawings just for fun. Right. I know the guy who wrote Astro Boy drew furry porn for fun. <laughs> Look, some of the best mangaka are known for their previous works as well as the works that made them famous. It's fine. There's plenty of, uh, there's plenty of gamers that, uh, dabble in pornographic works. What the fuck happened? Well, I, I love the argument for some games that come out and say, Oh, no wonder the character design looks like shit! Person only draws hentai, and I was like, A hentai artist probably knows the human body nor more than you know your own body. Have you ever drawn pornographic imagery before? Who, me? Yes. No. I have. It is immensely challenging. <laughs> <laughs> gotta get the dimensions right. You gotta get a pro. Gotta get the dimensions right. You know, like it's gotta look good, and it's also gotta be like sexy, and it's gotta be like you know fun to draw too. Fourteen. You stupid bitch. God, I hate you. How many do you have right now? Let's just put this uh, into perspective. By the way, you can just you can just ignore my screen for like the past ten minutes. A hundred and forty-three. Hundred and forty-three. Okay, I just found out you need hundred and ninety total to talk to every sage. Cock. Good luck, buddy! Well, I'm gonna go talk to all Sage. Alright, all right. I, 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 this is not looking good for me whatsoever! I will say I only have five emeralds. How many do you have? Also five. Okay. So it feel like they're gonna be tied mostly to, uh... Yeah, the ending. The story to, and all that. To the ending, yeah. Okay, well, if that's the case... Because I, I don't think that, uh, it, like, that story stage might not be the last one, you know? I see what you mean. Uh, so should I, like, upgrade my Sonics? Should I go fishing? Are we gonna do any fishing after the... after this island? Uh, what's the plan, mate? Well, I, I, I think a post-race a post -race, uh, fishing session would be a great way to kind of denouement on this thing into completion. Then I will go ahead... And go visit some elders to upgrade my Sonic. Exactly. Yeah, I, I don't, I don't care what you do. I'm kind of losing hope about me coming back at any point. Damn with, uh, all this, caterpillar! Uh, well, them caterpillars are certainly giving you a run for your money. 
It's the same caterpillar. It wants me. I don't he want it. You. He hates you. I don't. I don't like yeah. that he hates me. I'll talk to this sage at least. Yo. So did cyberspace actually interact? Why are you asking these questions, Sonic? Like, do you really have nothing to say to her? So how does cyberspace affect my brain? Is that really the most important thing right now? Sonic, the master of small talk. So, so, uh, the weather. How's the weather? <laughs> <laughs> we immediately went for the default. Amazing. So, I, I have a, uh, I have a question for you, since, uh, we're closing in on the end of this race, as it yes. seems. Yes. We agreed to get a like, fully upgraded Sonic, right? No. You're just completing it. Because, uh, what? I, uh, I already got the plat for this. And Me getting too. everything like that, it, 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 it takes time. And if we did, you know, I'm changing the rules then. Just, just finish the damn game. Pray I don't alter it any further. Like, I, I do, I do adore this game. This is a, a, a great, fantastic game. Whee! Way more fun than uh, I've had it has any in a, in a very, <laughs> very long time. Uh, more fun than it has any right to be. Uh, it has a right to be fun. They, they worked hard to make it fun. They, these guys, I, I can tell they tried hard. I can really tell when effort is uh, put on the table here. You know what I mean? Yeah. What? What? Bo Really? I don't like the way you're saying that. Welcome back, my dear Coco. Thank you, Sonic. Shall I grant you more power? I just got a... an increase in my boost gauge. What? Yeah, if you talk to the Coco that's collecting children... That doesn't sound right. <laughs> he just gave me a free boost to my power. I think that came from the Happy Birthday update. It's my proof from the new Cocos, perhaps? Did you, did you get a new one? I did. I did get a new one. Okay. I think that, that's what that, he's talking about. I, uh, I think that's what he's talking about. Yeah. That makes sense. Go ahead and increase for rings. Looks good. Okay. We well, I love that move, Sonic. It uh, takes me out of whatever I'm doing, and it also uh, completely makes you miss the target. <laughs> you didn't hit him a single time. <laughs> love, I just love that move. Love it. <laughs> Thank you, Sonic. Thank you for this gift of taking away control. I don't know if we talked about this, but uh, since you asked me in uh, Metroid Other M, what score would you give Sonic Frontiers? Oh, interesting. Uh, yeah, what you got? Uh, I, I would give it a generous, loving, smiling eight. Uh, yeah, that's what I was actually going to go for. This, this is a really fun game. I enjoyed getting the, uh, getting all the achievements in it. Fun time. It really felt... Yeah, it, it, it feels like that they had a, a good idea for what they wanted to do here. And any Sonic that has a good idea to rally around, I'm all in favor of. You want you don't want to play 06 again? Uh, d uh y y you know? How about you do that? I got you, mate. 29! Uh -huh. You want to know something interesting, speaking of Sonic 06? Yeah. I got curious, and I was like, okay, let's see if I can play Sonic 06 on my Series X. Of all of the Sonic games that came out on Xbox, guess which one is not backwards compatible or on the store? The one that got delisted. <laughs> I, guess, uh, yeah, I, I, guess, I guess I didn't know it, but uh, Sonic 06 got delisted. Got delisted! I didn't know that until I tried, until I tried it out in the Series X. They're like, this disc doesn't work with this console. I was like, what are you talking about? See, I, I think it's an effort to increase the value of the Sonic franchise. So anything that falls below a certain Metacritic score, they just kind of scrub. A standard, it. yeah. Which, you know, I'm, I'm all in favor of. We can all forget about Sonic Chronicles, right? We can all ignore Sonic Labyrinth. Oh, wait, no, we can't. It got added to Origins Plus. No! Well, at least now you can play with different characters, right? Yeah. Okay. So maybe that's why. Maybe they thought letting you play Sonic Labyrinth with Amy Rose was worth, uh, what was it, 60 bucks for all the, oh, oh. for like 14 Sonic games? Something ridiculous. 60? That's, that's not 60. It's like 40. Oh, it is? Oh, yeah. 
Oh, I thought it was a full price game. Okay, never mind. Oh no, that, that, that would, that would be how if they sold us the original four Sonic games and some Game Gear games <laughs> for sixty fucking dollars? Sixty dollars. All right. Let's... All right. I'm just wandering around aimlessly, trying to find hearts. I'm losing hope in this race. I uh, and this don't lose hope. Help! 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 Somebody! I need somebody. I need somebody help. I need to, no. to find some goddamn You little that. bitch! Get away from me! <clears throat> we're good. You might think we're not good, but we're good. So that's how we're gonna do. That's how we're gonna do things from now on. I'm gonna have to go to every map, not hit a fucking, uh, uh, make a marker, and then try and get that. Uh, one thing I actually found that helps extremely well for finding all these dumb hearts: uh, warp to a stage, and almost nine out of ten times the uh, the hidden chest is hearts, is a big collection of hearts. Yeah, I just got one uh, when the episode started. Nice. I will say that's a great feeling to open up a hidden chest in the ground and just like 15 hearts pop out of it. Oh. I think that's what I think that's what makes this game uh, work so well, which is the way everything feels. Yeah, it's still jank, yeah, it's still Sonic, but man, if it doesn't just feel good to do things. Running around is fun. I'm glad everybody understood you when you said, yeah, it's still Sonic. It's just like, yeah, I know what he's talking about. Yeah. Uh, I know what he's talking about. Is this a thing? Nope. Off we go. Alright, well, let's test your theory. Fast travel to... Or two. I feel like I might have already got some of these, though. I got that. Chest over here is probably a speed boost. I hope it was a key. That's not working. Let's go back to what we were doing before. Place a little more densely populated stuff. Alright, let's go. Off to a metropolis. Oh, there's a chest over here. It looks nice. A good chest. That's a good chest. Nice. At 155 now. Oh, he's catching up. One fifty-six. <laughs> <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs> Aw, Sage gets to experience Christmas. The miracle of Christmas. <laughs> Alright. Why would I want to explore the magic of capitalism? Christmas! I don't, I don't believe the Judeo-Christian roots of this holiday seem to exist in this current form anymore. Alright, let's take a The usage of a Christmas tree is a pagan ritual which is completely disconnected from the Judeo-Christian rituals. Do you think Sage is the type of person who would go on to an internet forum where everybody's having a good time, and then just say, you know that person was accused of being a pedophile, right? And just bring down the mood immediately? Yeah, but not in that way. You don't think so? She, no, she is a uh, huge realist. So she wouldn't, like, you know, say that, oh, that, that person is bad. She, she would... Uh, Point out logical fallacies. D Nerd. Okay. I'm just doing a map sweep right now just to make sure I'm not missing anything. There's like the she, like she, she, she'll be the one that say that uh, God or any kind of uh, deity isn't actually real. But Eggman exists. That that's my dad, not my God. <laughs> That's my dog, not my gut. Wait, no. I feel I, I feel like somewhere someone's going, See, Dad, there is a difference! <laughs> Alright. 
That's everything. Hello, Sage. You got everything? Yep. Is it over for us? Are we are we doomed? This is over. For... Is it time uh, to start? Well, is it time to start pack it in? Time to put there is a chaos everything inside, away. And the power is required to access it. Closing First, time. <laughs> Closing time. Is we're supposed to be looking after Eggman while he helps hunt down the emeralds. Uh, hey, look at that. Will be at his side when he needs All right, me. what's this? This is just For a now, speed boost. Focus on the task at That's hand. Use your power to Take start me over the system. Here. Hurry, our time is limited. <laughs> Yay! All right. Open the ancient gates. You got it. Open the gates. Time for a hacking mini game. <laughs> Hack into bits. Uh, I will say you're catching up remarkably well. Damn it! Ah, ah, no! Fuck! Damn it! Ah! Sonic fucked me up. Oh, 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 it's up there. I want to get up there. Don't you take me up there. Oh, I want to go there. I want that. I want that. And that, and that, and that, and that. There we go. 162! Ha <laughs> ha! 162! Hey, what about this one? How's this one do? It's like, uh, I don't see nothing here. It's up there. How up there again? Okay, over there, over there. Ramp over there. Good. Okay, good. Uh, okay, so, alright. Let's do that. You said I had zero chances of winning. Change Sonic, yet? It, you're the spirit of Christmas. You have a chance of winning this fight. I run a simulation on our present circumstances either. Ah, yeah. Can't tell you how You're weird it is to do a uh, chance. 2D sections in 3D, I and how uh, fruitless it is because you will fail. The threat <clears throat> face is beyond imagination. Hey, if there's even a one percent chance, I can turn that despair. I also love finding a rail. Where it's like, well, just take me I where I need to go, and it just launches me back. Yep. Nope. <laughs> okay. All right, here we go. Now we're oriented correctly. Oh my god! There's a hard icon on the way to the last emerald that you have to open in order to advance the plot. We're just making fun of you now. <laughs> Damn it! Why did they? Why did they do it like this? All right, so I'm not gonna do anything else uh, because once I grab the emerald, it's final boss time. Well, uh, we got about four minutes left. I got about 163. Uh, I think, I'm, uh... I've got an idea. Yeah? I'm just gonna, uh, grind for things to make myself more powerful, so yeah, you can ignore my screen for the longest time. Alright, I'm gonna see if I can have something happen. I will say, for the last, like, 15 of them, I just spun around in a circle, and a lot of them showed up, so I got lucky. Silver hammer, and... Get out of here. I don't want you, Silver Hammer. I don't Get want you. Get out of here, Silver Hammer. You ain't, you ain't no friend of mine. You ain't nothing, Silver Hammer. Silver Hammer ain't no friend of mine. No, no. Everyone's a friend of Silver Hammer. Coming soon to Cartoon Network. Why Cartoon Network? I don't know. It's been on my mind lately. The Silver Hammer. Weeknights on ABC. See, I still think Silver Hammer could be a good kid show. Like Steel Samurai. Da 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 da
Well, we just uh pantomime the kind of geeked out there a little bit. That was pretty great. So we get for being lifelong Ace Attorney fans, I guess. I know it's great. That's our punishment. <laughs> okay, I know this has happened to you before. Yeah. Have you, at just any random point, started to remember vividly details of a film you haven't seen in years? Oh, sure. All the time. I don't have any examples at the moment. So I don't have to right now, but sure, that's, sure, that's happened. Okay, now for the curveball. Have you ever uh, that exact same question, but for a film you didn't really like? <laughs> sure. <laughs> oh, sure, yeah. And all, like, I haven't seen A Bug's Life in 20 years. And I started, not, not only did I remember the theme in full for the ending there, I also, like, remembered lines from the film that I was able to quote verbatim. It's like, why? Uh, time, by the way. Why a bug's life? Do you like the movie? I haven't seen it in like 20 years. All right. Is it, is it, is it still okay? I mean, I haven't seen it in probably 25 years. You're a walking stick. It's funny. No go. You parasite. Though I did like how the stick bug was uh, Niles from Frasier, so... <laughs> David Hyde That's Pierce. why he sounded so familiar! Oh my god! Because <laughs> <laughs> I've been playing you Frasier clips uh, to, uh, a little I know! <laughs> I was like, holy <laughs> shit, I know who that is now! Well, then you're gonna love who Kelsey Grammer is then. He's the prospector from Toy Story 2! Wow! Oh my god, it's perfect! <laughs> so, so uh, we, we watched uh, Toy Story 2 again after... Uh, Catch him back up with Frazier. <laughs> and his first line of the movie is just so Frazier, where he just goes, Turn me around, bullseye. <laughs> <laughs> I can hear it! Oh, that's so funny! Turn me around, bullseye. Turn me around, bullseye. Oh, the prodigal son has returned. <laughs> yeah, I hope he brought a beer! <laughs> yeah. Well, that's gonna do it for today on Sonic Frontiers. Uh, Miss Goal has uh, leapt into the lead. And I think he has the opportunity. The opportunity is the key word. The opportunity, the potential to end this thing next time. Yeah, the the thing that scares me is you have an advantage over me because I haven't faced the final boss in hard mode. You have. I've never gotten the true ending of this game. So you say I need 190 uh, Hun hard, hard things? 190 will cover every sage. I've got 167. Uh, yeah, try running around in circles, because I'm going to be jumping into the final boss next time. Alrighty. That's just rings. Beautiful, useless rings. Oh, there's Beautiful. one heart. I got one. 168! You go. You're going down, you son of a bitch! Bring it on, buddy! See you next time.